Tomorrow is Earth Day, and although it's just one day to recognize our impact on the planet and find ways to make a difference, several organizations in the Valley have been shedding light on these issues year round. Meteorologist Jorge Torres shows us how one group is planting trees in an underserved community while reflecting on those we lost due to COVID-19. The hardest places to plant trees are the places that need it the most. That has been the case for decades in South Phoenix, one of the more vulnerable areas in the valley when it comes to heat and now the pandemic. This is a place for us to be able to do that while also providing that important shade and food for the community here and, and, and in a place that has been impacted much more than other parts of the valley. Amy Esposito is the executive director of Trees Matter, which is dedicated to inspire, promote, and increase a tree canopy here in the Valley. That work is being done here at the Spaces of Opportunity in South Phoenix. So far, 10 tiny citrus trees have been planted, but any more will cover the area later this year, bringing much needed relief from the heat while also acting as a memorial to those we lost due to COVID-19. Each tree carrying the names of our loved ones impacted. We haven't had a lot of opportunities to really reflect and recognize the, gra gra the gravity of how many people, how many amazing people and celebrate their lives that we've lost over the last year. We're planting for now, but we're also creating that legacy for these people and just for the future of the Valley. Trees Matter couldn't attack this endeavor alone, though. Can you imagine if I said, heck no, man, I don't want this partnership to ever expand ever again in life. This is where Darren Chapman and his group, the Tiger Mountain Foundation, comes in. They see the value in planting fruits and vegetables in formerly vacant lots, cultivating food and better communities, which historically have been underserved. We've uh, consulted over 100 organizations on how to build their community gardens, how to galvanize and mobilize that community, uh, and how to put Put this community building through community gardening together. With Trees Matter planting 100 food bearing trees, the Tiger Mountain Foundation saw this partnership as a win win. The resiliency project is so worth, worthwhile, like I said, uh, covering the systemic and the pandemic issues. Uh, and these beautiful trees are going to help us change that narrative in our community. Trees Matter and the Tiger Mountain Foundation planting the seeds for a brighter future in the valley. We are so excited, but also just honored to be a, uh, a part of facilitating such an important um, project for our community uh, in a way that's safe, it's outside, it's accessible to anybody, and it's just extremely needed. They're the quintessential partner that you always want. They're, they're conscientious of the systemic battle at Tiger Mountain Foundation that we need to fight, uh, like I said, on many levels. For Impact Earth, Jorge Torres, ABC 15, Arizona. Trees Matter is accepting donations and names to be added to the 100 trees at Spaces of Opportunity. If you'd like to contribute, check out this story on abc15.com. And the Impact Earth team is committed to helping you understand climate change and how we can all make a difference. You can find those stories right now on these streaming devices.